Hey everyone, it's Jolene and Myrto. Big thank you for those kisses. I am, well, we are in the basement, the mossy basement, where I do my artwork. And we are going to try out a new paint pour today. So I'm going <laughs> to flip this around. So this is my setup. I'm doing a pretty big canvas today. What is this? 15 by 30. So it's going to be an experiment. Um, these are some other pieces that I have worked on that are over here drying on the last one. Kind of not the best light. So for my setup, I always so I have a separate table. This is where I do my paint mixing. Um, getting my consistencies. Water will go in this cup. These will be my base colors and my regular colors. As for my canvas, I always level my canvas. So, here's my canvas. It's level. I use push pins underneath in each corner and then I fold extra paper if needed to get it level and I check that all across so the paint pours better and this is my basic setup here and all my paints it's just kind of kind of a mess here I'm gonna speed the video of my painting up here because these ones my bigger paintings take a much longer time so it just is kind of nice to speed it up a bit and here we go let's blow this beauty out This painting made me incredibly happy to do. It looks like the sea, the sea creatures, jellyfish, space, a bunch of things that I love, and it is fabulous. Here's a slow-mo to just take in the magnificence and beauty of this piece, all the cells, the just smoothness, beautiful. This shows a close-up of the area where I use my straw to add detail. If I don't like something, I'll use my straw, I'll add more paint, and try to make it the way that I like. I hope you enjoyed this video.